Chicago Alderman make a move to try to make the city streets safer by cracking down on drag racing and keeping the mayor's speed camera rules in place. They had a lot to do today. WGN's political, political reporter Taman Bradley is live at City Hall with the very latest. Taman. Lourdes and Ben, today City Council acted unanimously on multiple fronts, but not everything. The mayor had to overcome a challenge to her speed camera policy. Today, Mayor Lightfoot scored a victory, rallying enough alder people to keep her controversial speed camera policy on the books. The council rejected Alderman Anthony Beale's effort to raise the speed camera threshold back to 11 miles per hour. The vote was 18 to 26. People are driving too fast. They have been driving too fast through the pandemic. As part of her 2021 budget, Mayor Lightfoot lowered the threshold for a ticket to six miles per hour near parks and schools. When the policy took effect, Alderman Beale launched a crusade against it, leading to months of fighting. Well, it's, it's classic the uh, Chicago way. Um, the more time you give uh, the administration, the more they can twist arms. The mayor admitted the city would lose tens of millions in revenue if the policy was repealed, but her allies on council argued the lower threshold is about public safety. Speed kills. But people are out of control today, folks. They're totally out of control. They don't care. We see road rage all over the place. Um, I've suffered in the last seven years multiple, multiple deaths on roads where we could have fixed this due to having speed cameras slowing down the rate of speed that these cars are traveling. <laughs> To tackle the rise in car stunts and drag racing on city streets, the council unanimously approved new tools for police. CPD will have the power to impound cars used in drag racing and reckless sideshows using video as evidence. This is an issue uh, that absolutely has escalated through uh, the pandemic. It is about traffic safety. The key of this ordinance is that you can actually, if you have solid evidence that a vehicle has been used in, in uh, drag racing or a drifting incident, and it's well documented, the owner of that car does not to be, need to be present when that vehicle is towed. In other business, the council approved a city ethics proposal strengthening rules against nepotism and lobbying of council members. They also signed off on Mayor Lightfoot's plan for massive housing and development near public transportation. The plan is an effort to counter segregation. And the council codified the mayor's policy not to shut off water service for non-payment. The council is finished with formal business until September when the budget and public safety are going to be on the front burner. Live this afternoon from City Hall, Tamon Bradley, WGN News. Thank you.